Hello YouTube, this is See You on a Mission with a life update. I know it's been a while since the last time I even got on, made a video. A couple things, wasn't sure where I wanted to go with my channel, so wasn't sure what to do. My hair, I don't know what, I think it's almost a year, no, about a couple months. Um, since I done a new uh, update and I wasn't really sure where I wanted to go with my channel so I'm on vacation which is my normal vacation in Aruba which I do three weeks every year this is my wind down to start out my new year um, also you notice that I locked my hair up I'm probably I locked it up on um, 2000 September 2017 so I am a little bit over a year, and I have me some lock sprinkles. I might talk about how I put them in, what I want to do around the hair. So I might do a separate video just on hair, but this is where I'm at hair-wise. Um, locking my hair, loving it. Um, I'll take my back out. <clears throat> take my back out. Listen to me. It sounds weird. Take my back out. Um, but take my back of my hair out because I know y'all remember I have color ends. So this is my color ends, which you can kind of see clearly see the difference between the color ends that was before I locked my hair up and then year. So this is what the lock back look like. I keep it up because wearing it down, I'm not really comfortable wearing my hair down. But I like the way my front because my front was also cut, so I cut all the color off of it. That's why it's shorter than the back hair. But with my hair. When I started the locks, I was um, with five years natural when I started the locks. So this is five years here, along with some color damage and all that other stuff. And I decided to just let my hair do what it do. I started my locks with braids. I um, had someone braid it up and up doing small braids, but then decided I didn't want it small. I wanted them a little bit bigger and then also I didn't want anyone else to do it I want to freshly do my hair whatever way it happens the way it locks you can see bunching but again I will probably have more videos to come which is just like introducing myself back to YouTube get some more video of life videos um, minimalist videos hair videos just life in general as a older woman every little issues dating issues life issues just trying to be balanced you know so this is my video to get back into it you can see my hair this is how it looks i do not wear makeup i don't know if i brought that up but i think i'm gonna be more natural i like leaning towards natural i also go around with the products and stuff around just trying to live a more natural um lifestyle but since I figure I'm in Aruba for two, one more week, and thought I would start getting back into my YouTube, so maybe I'll do a week of blogging, random topics, random videos, trying to play catch up, all that stuff, trying to be better with my skin. You know, I'm darker now because I've been out in the sun for two weeks, been in Aruba for two weeks, but I want to go, I want to talk about all that, so. This is hair. This is skin after two weeks in Aruba. I've been scrubbing. That's another thing I wanted to bring up as a older woman of your nightly routine and your skin routine and things we need to look up, think on, all that other stuff. But I thought this was the sun's going down. We'll be in a little sun. Most of my other videos will have a little bit more sun to them. But I decided to start tonight. I do love my hair. Other people might not, but I'm loving it. I gave I gave myself another five more years uh, or six years being locked and see where I want to go. I gave originally when I went natural, I gave myself five years to figure out what I wanted to do. Did I want to stay natural? Um, made it to five years and decided to lock up the hair because detangling is a pain in the you know what. 
So that's one part. That was main, my main reason that I decided to want to lock my hair. It is just ideal not spending so much time on my hair. Because a whole, hour, a whole day spending to wash your hair, detangle, condition, and then put it in the style is too much, just too much to spend on hair. I don't want a whole day being dedicated to hair. So, Nana Doe, this is it. You know, letting it grow, letting it do. Love my color. I don't think I'm going to color my hair anymore either, but. I can't say never because I love my pink hair. I love everything pink, which you can kind of tell what your nails need to be done. Um, you know, everything must be pink. Pink top, pink bottom. But we will get more into that as the weeks go on. But this is the hair. Oh, also gray and trying to stop coloring my hair. But tomorrow I'll let you see that a little bit more. Um, trying to, I used to hint in my hair to get rid of the grays that I have at my hairline, which is where I'm at. Um, but I'm at the point now, I'm just gonna let them grow in. They're not bad, it's just, they're sparse. I just, something I have to a set, get used to. And also I'm gonna see what the gray hair looks like when it gets locked. I think that would be an awesome look. I've seen some gray women and the hair looks awesome. I want to be one of those where my hair look awesome, whether it's locked or not. I want my hair to have gray specks, but I always will have me some pink in here no matter what. Look at that one. That's why I don't wear my hair down because I have little bunchies. I, I like my little bunchies. I appreciate my little bunchies, but it doesn't make for a nice hairstyle when you just want to have your hair down. So, and that's what I have going on. This is all from here to here is the year is my natural hair when I started my lock. This is my natural hair that wasn't colored a year before I started my lock. And this is all the color hair. I keep saying one day. I think I might want to cut it off, but not until it's way, way long. I think I want nature to take its course. If it breaks off, it breaks off. If not, I think I'm going to keep my color like that. But I won't say if I'll color again. But you definitely see the different transitions. That's the beauty of it. I could see where I was in my journey. Look at that. This is all a year of lock. A year of natural hair with no color. And my five-year nat natural hair that has been colored and everything. I used to also reach my almost... Maybe like two or three inches above my waist, and it shrinks up a lot. Sorry, I'm hoping this is loud enough too, but it shrinks up a lot. If not, I'll do a voiceover, but I'm hoping it's pretty clear. You can hear me with this in my ears because I don't want you to have to hear the ocean and all that background wind and everything. But we're already eight minutes in. Just wanted to be a quick thing. Show my hair, show them. I'm gonna try to get back into um, lifestyle videos. It's just gonna be random. I think I like the randomness of videos. I just got finished watching a person um, video. It's a male video, which I thought was pretty interesting because it gave me a male point of view of how he looks at women. So I think I'm gonna subscribe to his channel because I really did like it. It just gives me another insight on how men think. And I think that's good for women to kind of understand. And also men to understand how women think too. So, but on that note, this is See You on a Mission. I'm in my favorite place in the world, which is Aruba. And I'll, I'll see you a little later. Probably see you tomorrow. Talk to you later. Bye.